Yo, what is up you guys? Welcome back to another video. It's Alson Gaming here and I really hope you guys will enjoy this episode on the SMP that I've created. Um, if you guys have not joined it, it'll be in the description and I really hope to see you guys joining soon. After joining my server, I went straight to mining irons. After scavenging the cave, I found iron and there was no way for me to get down so I water bucket and I know I'm bad at it. Don't judge me in the comments. After I gathered all of the irons, I realized there's not that much irons there and I need to go searching for more, so I went home because I realized that I have two stacks of iron and all of this mining was for nothing. So it was time for me to create the iron blocks and it turns out I might have to go mining again because it didn't give me as much as it should and it turns out the mining weren't for nothing after all. I was going to go mining and then I realized that it's night time and I bolted back upstairs, went to my room and go to bed for the other day. The next morning, Bahu tried to swim in lava. I was going to go mining for obsidian but I realized I have unlimited lava source in water and a diamond pickaxe so why not make use of it. Now it's time for me to make the beacon, but as I search for the beacon, I've never made a beacon before and I click on the beacon and I realize that I didn't have a nether star. I, 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 okay. So I searched all of my chests to see if I have one and luckily I did because I was never going to go that far for a nether star. So I made a beacon. And a little while after that, Bahu came to my house and I passed him the iron blocks to make it for me because I'm lazy. So we were having a little discussion of where it should go and I say when I put it nearest to B spot base, you know, the admin base. So we're, we're going to put it here and it turns out we need more irons, as I said, and I... Oh my god, we have to go back in the mining place. We went down to the mining shack and start scavenging for irons and a lot of things we come across. Cobble, iron, gold, anything. So I went down to this iron place because I remember I left a few little irons down there and I grabbed the iron. Just to find out that Bahu had iron blocks the whole time or iron ignorance. I don't know, but he had them. And he, ha and he had us came down to the mining shack for nothing. After that, we went to admin base to gather all the iron blocks he had in his ender chest. And after that, Bahu started building the beacon like a total simp he is. So it was time to place the beacon and I stepped away to look at its glory just to see the advancement that Bahu has made the beacon and that is a total lie because I'm the one who placed it but I'm not really anyways we went back to the cave because we found out the beacon has three layers and we needed four for the achievement that we wanted so we started scavenging for more irons into the cave so my friend Bahu went AFK and I thought it would be a good idea to box him into a cave and put lava on top and get his reaction to it so he started digging and I thought for a second that the lava would about to reach him but I accidentally placed the gravel there and it just fall down and it started making an entire mess leading to him escaping which means my plan ruined. I went back to base to finish up the beacon that Bahu have left for me because he left the game which means I have to do this on my own which totally sucks I don't have my bot anymore. So I went inside for some iron blocks and a shovel to dig around it and build underneath it. So I start by removing the dirt from the beacon. So I've digged down a little bit so I can clear all the dirt from underneath the beacon so I can fill it with iron blocks and get my fourth layer of irons. After clearing all of the dirt I started filling in the iron blocks from the outside area. Up during the outside, I wanted him to do the inside of the iron blocks. So I started doing the outside layer again so it can evenly match with my beacon and I could get a four layer 
instead of a three layer. I was going to activate the beacon, then I realized I had no diamond, iron, emerald, or nether brick, so I had to back away from that one. With the leftover irons I have, I bring them back into Iron Ignot so I can make a full suit of armor for my armor stand in my room. With leftover irons that I got, I went to go and activate the beacon with it. That is it for this episode. I really hope you guys enjoyed this episode on the SMP. And remember, if you guys haven't joined it, it will be in the description. Alright, that's it. Bye!